hello all chess lovers hope all of you are great in this video we are going to talk about an important topic double attack we'll go into the video without any further delay e4 e5 knight f3 knight c6 bishop c4 nf6 ng5 i am trying to show you what is double attack exactly now after d6 it is a sample move after an into f7 uh, this knight is attacking both uh, the queen and rook this is known as a double attack now uh, we'll go to the core of the video before going into the video if you didn't subscribe my channel please subscribe your each subscription will be a great motivation for me to do many videos like this the main motive of this video is to show you not only uh, what is double attack and uh, how do you do and um, the main motive of this video is to show you you will be having uh, double attacks even in these type of position in which you didn't see them uh, by miscalculation so what i'm trying to say is you should calculate each and every move before making even um, it seems uh, there is nothing in position e4 c5 knight f3 knight c6 this is a close this lane after f4 g6 knight f3 bishop g7 bishop c4 all are uh, quite decent moves all are uh, developing moves and uh, all are book moves you may have have been seen if you are preparing for an close this is lane i have flipped the board uh, through black side because uh, this is an trap for right after ng e7 d3 double o bishop e3 i recommend you to pause the video if you are an experienced player now itself you have been spotted that that uh, white piece is hanging if you have done that uh, please let me know in the comment section below now if you didn't find that please pause the video and try to find the answer because this is what uh, everyone miss in these type of positions uh, this position at first glance looks absolutely normal both sides are developed decently both sides have uh, castle both sides have uh, developed their minor pieces both sides are trying to make complete their opening preparation now uh, in this position white loses on piece in two or uh, three moves i recommend you to pause the video i hope uh, all of found the answer if you didn't found that that is no problem everything comes from practice you improve in chess from practicing it uh, fits for chess and for life so the answer is d5 after d5 this bishop is attacked if you retreat like uh, bishop b3 then d4 is a double attack this little pawn is attacking the both bishop and knight okay what if you try to take with e into d5 e into d5 e into d5 this all is in calculation you should try to calculate uh, two or three moves like this after in into d5 in into d5 bishop into d5 queen into d5 at last you have an extra piece what if after in into d5 instead of playing in into d5 what if bishop b3 ahain you are going to play d4 attacking both pieces this is known as double attack i hope all of got a basic idea about double attack what if bishop retreats to bishop b3 directly then we will also play d4 directly attacking these two pawns so at first glance bishop e3 looked completely a normal move it is looking like a developing move at uh, many of the sicilian positions bishop e3 is a main move while developing an dark squared bishop they will be playing bishop e3 queen d2 uh, making an queen and bishop battery but in this position unfortunately as the knight is on c3 you are uh, suffering a double attack like this so moral of this video is don't um, play fastly uh, don't uh, judge any move so quickly this move is good uh, we are not going to get anything from this our opponent is so clever he is uh, playing all principles though 
we apply all principles there are some uh, things may happen like this but uh, i will, i'm not saying this will happen more often if you are playing with an uh, experienced opponent but things like this may happen so that's all for this video hope all of like this video comment your thoughts in the comment section below if you didn't subscribe our channel please do subscribe your each subscription will be a great motivation for me to do many videos like this thank you for watching and take care